Honestly, I think I made a pretty penny for two coins that were sitting in my aunt's attic, so it's a win. I have a Roman ancient bronze duck lamp. I'm almost afraid to touch it, really, man. The word ancient just scares me. <laughs> I don't want to be the one who breaks it. Yeah, right? <laughs> <laughs> I purchased a duck lamp from an antiquities gallery in Manhattan's Upper East Side a couple years back. I'd like to sell a duck lamp because I want to add some new pieces to my collection with the money I would get from it. All right, so what exactly is this? This was a, a lamp used in ancient times, in the Roman culture, to light up a room, also possibly for ceremonial purposes. Yeah, I was going to say, um... It looks a little fancy to just be your average household lamp. I know these lamps are fairly common and every household, you know, had at least a couple lamps, maybe even one per person, because exactly. once the sun went down, this is what you would use to see. This is kind of slidable. If you move it gently, um, it reveals this opening. Uh, you put some olive oil in there. You just put the wick part into this little hole right here and you just light it up. All right. I've seen my fair share of lamps at the shop, but nothing as fancy or ancient as this. The first century is really old, so I'm gonna need some help before I even think about making an offer. When you throw words out like ancient, yeah. it kind of scares me to ask you what you want <laughs> for it.